Good afternoon, T.O.P. Nation, and welcome to the T.O.P. Be Inspired and Fire. I am Elder Fina Space, coming to you about walking in a narrow road. It's going to be coming from Matthew 7 and 14. Small is the gate, and narrow the leap that leads to life, and only a few find it there. The Bible describes the road that leads to eternal life as narrow, and only a few find it. The gate is considered small because God, the Son, is the only breed that can recover the fall of man. Everyone has the opportunity to enter heaven and bow before King of Kings, which means we may be, we all are equal. We all have an equal chance to get into the kingdom of God. We may be separate by God, by our sins. However, every individual God created has an invitation. I like that. An invitation to enter an eternity of heaven by walking the narrow path, which is God that reconciliation through our personal relationship with Christ. I want to inspire you today to consider giving your life to Christ, who has made the highest sacrifice that man on this earth could ever have made. He made that on the cross, the resurrection from the tomb, and the ascension to heaven so that we, me, you, can have eternal life. Life today is so short and I want you to really think about what can I do for Christ? Because he said everything that you do for Christ is the only thing that's going to last. It's really the only thing that is going to allow us to excel, to actually see his face. I inspire you, inspire you to strive for eternal life. Strive to be whole. Strive to see his face. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and everything will be added unto you. Meaning everything that you ever ask for God's going to give it to you. Because all is right there. He said he'll give us the desires of our heart. So let's stay on that narrow path. Don't widen it out. Just do what God asks you to do. And I promise you, you may dress up. But let's dress up in a mask and not in a casket. Especially if it don't mean us going to heaven. I pray that you will actually seek God, and I ask that you will actually seek his faith for today. And if anybody has never told you, or you haven't heard it today, Elvis Faith loves you.